The U.S. ambassador to Ghana, Stephanie Sullivan, on Friday joined the overlord of the Gonja traditional area, Yebongura Tuntimba Boresa, and members of the Global Share Alliance to commemorate Share Day with a tree planting event within the grounds of the Japa Palace in Damangu. The event is part of the Action for Share Parkland initiative, which was launched in 2020 to preserve and protect share parklands across West Africa. It is estimated that 8 million share trees are lost every year. The loss of the shared trees does not only destroy the biodiversity of the entire ecosystem, resulting in erosion, flooding, and desertification, but impacts the livelihood of millions of people who live in these regions. To mitigate these effects, USAID is supporting Global Share Alliance members to undertake cross-regional activities including tree planting, parkland management training, advocacy and social media campaigns in Benin, Burkina Faso, Côte d'Ivoire, Ghana, Mali, Nigeria and Togo under the Sustainable Share Initiative. These activities as well as this tree planting today show how we can work together to take action to protect the ecosystem and preserve our planet. However, it's imperative that communities lead action at the local level. Restoration begins with a clear understanding of your landscape and your needs. Each one of us here must take action to promote climate resilience, and tree planting is a very positive first step. She commended the overlord of the Gonja traditional area, the Yagbongura, for his decision to ban logging and commercial charcoal production in the Savannah region. The Yagbongura, in his speech read on his behalf by Bipeura Abdullah Jinapo II, directed all 21 paramounts in the Gonja traditional area to make land available for the planting of shared trees by the project. To this effect, and to succeed in the action for shared parklands in the Savannah region, I'm resolved with the leadership of the regional House of Chiefs that with immediate effect, a committee should be put in place, headed by my good side, the Premier for the second, to work in collaboration with Global Share Alliance in this project for this noble intervention to achieve its set goals and objectives in the region. Finally, Your Excellency, on all invited guests, the Savannah regime is poised to support the project and protect it to achieve its set goals and objectives in the region. The region is assuring our partners of our commitment and dedication to fully work. Ambassador Sullivan and Bipura together with other industry players planted shared trees at the Japa Palace to mark the shared day. To support the commitment to the tree life, the, to the tree of life, the TCA has committed to support the shared landscape and parklands restoration project with 40,000 early share seedlings with the shortest gestation period carefully produced under the direct provision by the Cocoa Research Institute of Ghana, which is also under the Cocoa Board. This is expected to be distributed to 1,000 farmers targeting women, mainly women. From the Japa Palace here in Damango, I am Richard Fogo reporting for City News.